Uh, hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to use Cobalt to create uh, something like contact form or maybe surveys or ordering form just like a form extension, not like a CCK but uh, to just to collect some information from your users. So I have already created the order type, so I'm going to uh, and show you these two fields. It's a select and text area. Of course, you may want, uh, and let me do it, uh, to add some other fields which will be useful. For example, email field. Or you can add username or other fields. You can use all power of the Cobalt, all these great fields for users to collect information. So after you created your type, you create a section. I have already created a section, so it's not very boring for you and I don't spend uh, too much time on this. I just point some things. Uh, I just switched off personalization uh, here and uh, I've configured the table templates so not to show all the fields. I selected the order as a type, so I, I bind it, uh, the created type and the section together. So that's uh, basically all. So there's much more you can do, of course, but this is not the point of this tutorial. So what I want to show you is how to um, actually I have to save and close it. But there is a little small trick in the content article manager. I've created an article and I've called it article congratulation. Let me find it. This is the congratulation article. This article basically shows uh, congratulation message of submitted form and we want users after they submit the form they get to this article so how do we do this let's close this article and let's go to menu i've created the hidden menu the reason i call it hidden because it will never be visible on the front end so because i will not publish any model with this menu on the front end so it will not be visible or accessible by any user i just want to create a link so this link will be used later for redirection. So I, and I've created already link. So this is linked to the static single article, the same the article. So when you create this link here, you can see the URL. So I've copied this URL and then I went to Cobalt types. I edited order type and there's a special parameter. So here in submission parameters, we can enter redirect URL. So and also choose here where we want to redirect user after submission to the redirect to the URL below and the URL below to this static article. So I think you you've understood that we use this menu just to create this URL. In fact, if you know how to combine this URL by hands. You could just write it um, here, just type it without even creating a menu. This is main trick here. Let's see how it works. Let's open Chrome and I'll log in as a registered user. I've created the link to add new article here. So there's uh, some buttons, but I actually don't want this button to be here. So let me show you how you can avoid it. Let's go to order. Here are the parameter of the buttons. Because when user click make order, I don't want him to see any other buttons, uh, but only save. So user just uh, choose what he wants. He just add the comment. You can, of course, uh, hide this metadata or do everything you want, email, the username, and just add the article. As a final step, user gets to this static article we've created. It's a Cora Joomla article, which shows and confirm that that form was submitted successfully and that all information was collected. So that's it. And this information has been saved in Cobalt you can create in the user menu the special link. Let me open another part. 
and I'm logged in here as a super user and in the user menu I can see the check orders if I go to check orders I can see that someone have just ordered this uh, tour so I can open this order I can see this order and um, in fact I can see the email and I can respond to this email uh, who've just uh, sent me with some message I can add attachments and just uh, send the response from here the whole total point here is that you can not only use Cobalt as a article manager and article constructor for users to read this article and to be accessible from the front end. You can use it as a simple form generator which saves form data in form of articles which you only can see. So the idea behind this is very simple, but uh, it's very powerful. You don't need any other extensions to do that. You can use Cobalt to collect information.